All right, now, this is the culminating activity to make sure we understand Le Chatelier's principle. All right, let's first summarize. This is on some page. I don't know. I should always check, but I forget. So make sure you are there. Are you stressed? Let's summarize. All reversible reactions in a closed system will come to a state of equilibrium. If a stress is applied to a system at equilibrium, the system readjusts so that the stress is relieved. This is Le Chatelier's principle. I meant to underline, not cross out. The stress may be a change in temperature or concentration. If a gas is present in the reaction, another possible stress is a change in pressure. Consider the following equation. All right, this has all of them combined. 4 HCl plus O2 goes to 2 Cl2 plus 2 H2O plus heat. All right, so we have gas. And we have heat. I want you to work through with your lab partner 1 through 7, and then we will work through them together in just a little bit. I'll give you two minutes to work through those. While you're doing that, I'm going to do some other stuff. You will see it, but don't watch. It's boring. All right, let's look at these together. All right, if you got all these correct, you are great. You can do my test. So number one, which side of the equation would be favored if more Cl2 is added? There's the Cl2. Add, I go away. These are reactants. These are products. So I go towards reactants. Which side of the equation would be favored if water is removed? All right, if I take away, I stay. So since I'm removing products, I stay towards the products. All right, number three, which side of the favor would be favored if more heat? If I increase the heat, I go away, so towards reactants. Which side of the equation would be favored if heat is removed? That would be the opposite, so towards products. Uh, which side of the equation would be favored if more pressure is added? I have four moles here. 5 moles, so I would go towards the side with less moles. That would be towards products. Which side of the equation would be favored if more pressure is removed? Towards reactants. And this is a big fat no. 